A vehicle exploded on Wednesday on the Rainbow Bridge linking Canada with the United States at Niagara Falls, prompting authorities to close that border crossing and the three others between western New York and southern Ontario, officials said. It looked like it was in slow motion, said Ricky Wilson, who witnessed the explosion. And I said my god it's a car, he added, the FBI Joint Terrorism Task Force was mobilized to investigate the incident, according to New York Governor Kathy Hochul. Two people in the vehicle were killed in the explosion and one Border Patrol official was injured, according to several media reports that cited unnamed law enforcement sources. Later, sources familiar with the matter told Reuters the crash was likely caused by a reckless driver, according to early assessments. The vehicle began to turn sideways and went under something overhead and then it hit something over there. And my prayer was just, please don't let it, any of the officers, you know, get hit over there. And then all of a sudden, black smoke, no explosion. We all heard, the people in the building heard it, the uh, metal on metal. Then all of a sudden I saw black smoke and then fire. There was no explosion.